Summary Brandon's forgetfulness and lack of interest in Julia's wedding vision caused tension in their relationship during a church scene in 90 Day Fiancé Season 8, angers fans who called him a horrible person. Despite Brandon initially forgetting the significance of May 9, the date held sentimental value for Julia as it was the day he wrote her his first message saying, you look like my future wife. Fans speculate that Brandon's behavior and forgetfulness are part of a fake storyline and question the authenticity of the couple's relationship, although they are still together after the show. Although Brandon Gibbs and Julia Trubkina appeared to be the couple most in love in 90 Day Fiancé Season 8, the Virginia lad forgot an important date. Whether it be his mama's boy status in one of the best reality TV shows or his tendency to throw Julia under the bus, Brandon proved he's a major contender for the bad guy title of season 8. However, a church scene from 90 Day Fiancé, season 8, episode 13 was angering because Brandon claimed Julia's dream wedding wasn't his vision. How could Brandon forget the significance of May 9th as Julia's preferred wedding date when it was discussed in an earlier episode? With the world coming to a standstill around them and 54 days left before Julia's visa expired, Brandon, Betty, and Ron toured a local church to finalize a wedding venue. But Brandon showed the same enthusiasm when Julia picked her bridal gown and got confused when she asked him the number of guests attending their wedding. Worse, Brandon even forgot why May 9th was so important to Julia, didn't seem bothered when she got annoyed and failed to console her when she shed tears. The Dinwiddie resident spoke about not sharing the female fantasy of a wedding day and claimed Julia was asking him to be someone he is not. For many reasons, the couple didn't appear on 90 Day Fiancé Season 10. Brandon got called out by 90 Day Fiancé fans Fans on Reddit called out the 90 Day Fiancé star instantly for being a horrible person, claiming Julia did not deserve to be treated this way, especially since she has already sacrificed a lot for the farm life. Reddit users complained that hearing Brandon speak down to and mock Julia was like watching an entirely different person. However, Brandon started the conversation about having the wedding on Mother's Day weekend. As Betty pointed at Julia's neck and embarrassed 27-year-old Brandon for the love bite, Brandon revealed, we've decided May 9th. As Betty and Ron felt it was a terrible day, Julia explained it was the same day Brandon had written her his first message, which read, You look like my future wife. Brandon and Julia settled on May 9th for their wedding but because his parents asked the 90-day fiancé couple to reconsider, Brandon snapped at them, saying, I don't care. If Julia wants the 9th, I will do the 9th. Brandon also confessed that he felt good about having a date that made Julia happy. My mom wasn't a fan of it, but it's our wedding, the pest control technician told the camera. A 90 Day Fiancé fan recalled this scene and posted, he's doing this because their entire storyline is so fake he can't remember the lies. The fan added that the 9th was super important, when the producers needed drama, on that older episode. But on the latest one, he can't remember what he was supposed to say, observed the TLC watcher while adding that they're getting really sick of the show. Another fan noticed that during her crying scene, it looked like Julia was trying not to laugh, with a different comment adding that Brandon's forgetfulness and disinterest are a part of the fake storyline. Someone also wrote about Julia liking Brandon's posts on social media, showing they're possibly married and still together. Hence, their 90-day fiancé plot is not worth investing in. Given that Brandon and the Gibbs have been accused of faking their storyline, including the pregnancy scare, they weren't fan favorites. Surprisingly, Brandon and Julia are still together after 90-day fiancé. 90 Day Fiancé airs Sundays at 8 p.m. Eastern Time on TLC.
Source. Reddit 90 Day Fiancé 90 Day Fiancé is a reality TV series that follows the trials and tribulations of non -U. S. Citizens who travel from abroad each season to meet their potential spouses utilizing AK-1 visa. This three-month visa gives the pair 90 days to determine whether or not their romantic and life goals are aligned before they're forced to return home unmarried. Drama and tension unfold as the couples navigate the tricky dynamics of international marriage.